This is one of the things that Robux have actually been doing internally for a while because they've had WebSocket support internally. And Roblox actually builds all of its UIs using React, uh, React Lua. So the Roblox app itself is actually, it's basically a Roblox experience. It's using the Roblox rendering engine of like, you know, screen GUIs and frames and stuff, but it's all built using React Lua. It's, what, it's one of their ways of trying to make sure that the Roblox UI ecosystem and the Lua ecosystem works for everyone, because if it works for them, yes. then they're going to improve it. You know, if they have problems with it, they're going to fix those problems and then everyone else can yeah, um, so it's have a, those fixed solutions. It's a smart strategy. It, it definitely means that they're doing a lot more updates to UI recently than they have before. I think a lot yeah. of the UI layouts and things came from them trying to, to use it internally. Um, yeah. It does feel like they've kind of chosen the hard option, right? Because like using React Native and using React for Web would, would be easier but would leave their own UI system behind. So it's, it's quite nice that they've been using that.